As Minister of National Defence, my top priority is the safety and protection of Canadians, working in collaboration with our partners, including the United States, NORAD and other departments. Canada was tracking a high altitude object over central Yukon. North American Aerospace Defense Command detected this object and launched Canadian and U.S. fighter aircraft to investigate. The object was visually identified using fighter aircraft assigned to NORAD. If it is found to have originated in China, what do you think the potential impact could be with regards to our diplomatic relations? Today, at the direction of the Prime Minister, aircraft assigned to NORAD successfully took down this high-altitude airborne object at approximately 3.41 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. ...and protection of Canadians, working in collaboration with our partners, including the United States. To the best of our knowledge, this was the first time that a NORAD operation has downed an aerial object. The object was flying at an altitude of approximately 40,000 feet, had unlawfully entered Canadian airspace and posed a reasonable threat to the safety of civilian flight. The object was downed approximately 100 miles from the Canada-United States border over Canadian territory in central Yukon. When we first started tracking uh, this object, it was uh, dark and we needed to make sure that we had a visual of it and so needed to wait for daylight to emerge. Secondly, we needed to make sure uh, that there was uh, infrared or missile lock capability and that was something that both the F 22s and the F-18 pilots were working on together. So as I said, it was a NORAD mission, it was NORAD capabilities, and our armed forces worked very closely uh, with the U.S. armed forces to ensure a successful downing of this object that we had concern about. ...of the object at this time. However, I will say that we... Recovery operations are now underway and will be supported by the Canadian Armed Forces in conjunction with the RCMP. This coordinated operation will allow a further investigation into this object. We have no further details about the object at this time other than it appears to be a small cylindrical object and smaller than the one that was downed off the coast of North Carolina had unlawfully entered Canadian airspace and posed a reasonable threat. Let me assure all Canadians that Canadians are safe. There is no reason to believe that the impact of the object in Canadian territory is of any public concern. The Canadian Armed Forces with the RCMP will recover and will analyze the object underscores the functionality. Do you think, or your counterparts in the U.S., do you think that it possibly could have originated in China? At this point, uh, we are continuing to do the analysis on the objects, and we will make sure uh, that that analysis is thorough. And so it would not be prudent for me to uh, speculate on the origins of the object at this time. However, I will say that we are continuing to work closely with our NORAD partners and our U.S. partners, and we will make sure uh, that we leave no stone unturned in the analysis of the data that we are now going to be turning to analyze.